Get the S9 OLED screen assembly connected. Please be noted that the housing used for test in the video is an S9 Plus housing. And the test result won't be affected. Press the power button to turn on the phone. All going well. Let's start with glass lens cutting. We need to cut through the glass lens area between the earpiece speaker and OLED. Place the OLED screen assembly onto the operating panel of the cutting machine. Then place the cutting blade about 1 cm to 3 cm above the OLED screen assembly. Slide back and forth to cut the glass lens. As you can see, the glass lens has been cut through completely. Fix the OLED screen assembly onto the operating panel of the separating machine. Turn on the power switch. Then drop an appropriate amount of alcohol into the cut area. Pry off the top glass lens with the blade. For better operating of the LCD cutting wire, we need to break the upper left and upper right corner of the glass lens with a breaker. Remove broken glass gently with the blade. Once done, a part of the OLED is exposed so that the LCD cutting wire can make its way through the gap against the glass lens. Please be noted that due to the special design of the curved screen, we need to fix the free end of the wire in the upper right corner first. Then push the opposite end into the gap between the glass lens and OLED with the help of the blade. Repeat the operation to separate the glass lens, on the other side from OLED. Now we need to remove residual glue on the OLED. Once done, clean thoroughly with glue remover soap nano sponge. Since the OLED is glued to the mid-frame by mid-frame adhesive strip, we need to insert metal pry piece between the mid-frame and the adhesive strip. Slide back and forth again. Then insert metal pry piece between OLED and the adhesive strip. Slide back and forth. Meantime, pull out the loose adhesive strip. Then pull the adhesive strip out slowly and completely. Please be noted that in addition to the mid-frame adhesive strip, there is also adhesive underneath the four corners and the back side of OLED. Let's start with adhesive underneath the four corners.
Once done, insert a plastic pry piece between OLED and the mid-frame. Separate OLED from the mid-frame slowly with the help of alcohol. The operating panel can be rotated 180 degrees for easy operation with the other side. Now the OLED has been separated completely from the mid-frame. Test again. All going well. Place OK into the corresponding position of the OK lining mold. Apply pressure to get it adhered tightly. Then embed the OK lining mold into the base. Apply pressure to fit the OK against the rubber block. Once done, press carefully to remove bubbles inside. Prepare a new glass lens. Place the new glass lens into the glass lens mold. Tear off the protective film of the OCA. Then tear off the protective film on the back side of the glass lens. Embed the glass lens mold into the base. Place the whole mold into the laminating machine. The machine starts to work. Laminating finished. Take out the whole mold. Then solidify the oak laminated glass lens in the high power UV lamp for 5 seconds. The glass lens and the Oka have been laminated successfully. Place the Oka laminated glass lens into the glass lens mold. Embed the OLED rubber block aligning mold into the base. Place the OLED screen into the OLED aligning mold. Apply pressure to get it adhered tightly. Then embed the OLED aligning mold into the base. Apply pressure to fit the OLED screen with the rubber block. Once done, remove the OLED aligning mold. Clean the OLED screen thoroughly with N hexane. Tear off the Oka protective film. Then embed the glass lens mold into the base. Continue to place the whole mold into the laminating machine. The machine starts to work. Laminating finished. Take out the whole mold. Then solidify the OLED screen assembly in the high power UV lamp for 3 minutes. Put the OLED screen assembly into the bubble removing machine.
Once finished, take out the OLED screen assembly. Get the OLED screen assembly connected. Press the power button to turn on the phone. All going well. The curved screen of Samsung S9 has been refurbished successfully.